this is the most important feature we are going to address into the next major release uh, so VirtualBox 6.0 where our target is to, to get VBOX as the development solution for the cloud and um, by using automation on, on a DevOps environment built on VBOX uh, automation like for example GitHub boxes or an attendant installation, so automated installation of operating systems and software on top, uh, running on your own laptop or desktop environment. Uh, by VBOX, uh, we, are now, we, are, we have now the option to, to upload those images to, to OCI, directly to OCI, and get the same environment running on, on production systems for, for OCI. Um, this one is the new VirtualBox 6.0 GUI, and here uh, on the within the GUI, so we have the export option as we always had, and uh, yeah, let's pick up one system to to export like this Oracle Linux 7 machine. Uh, we have different formats between them. We have also Oracle Cloud Infrastructure. Here I can choose which profile, so which tenancy, which configuration running on OCI uh, will be the destination of my VM. Now. The VBOX is connecting to, to OCI using Web Services API. Um, here I have the option to configure my VM on, on OCI. I can give, for example, uh, the description for the VM. I can choose on which bucket the image will be saved, the configuration, so the shape for my VM the size of the virtual disks on which virtual cloud network the option to get a public IP address or not and end of the also the high availability domain uh, for, for my VM and here I can start the export at this time VBOX uh, directly upload the image of this machine of my development machine on, on OCI uh, the export to OCI is divided into two main phases. The first one is the real upload of the images, and the second one is the instance creation and, and startup on, on OCI. And usually, uh, obviously, this is something that uh, depends on the bandwidth available, uh, but at the end, uh, within 20 to 30 minutes, you, you can get an instance running on OCI. At the same time, obviously, you can also check on on OCI uh, browser user interface what is going on and, the, and here for example we can see that the import of our images is running and we can also see the details of the image that we are going to upload. Once the two phases uh, so the upload and the instance creation have been completed uh, by the, the OCI console I can see that uh, I have one new uh, instance running a new compute instance running I can also check the details of my instance as, it, as you can see the configuration is the same that I've defined on, on VirtualBox while, while exporting the same and obviously uh, by getting the, the, the public IP address of, of my uh, instance uh, running on OCI I can log into the same and start to work over there.